Hi families, happy Thursday. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week. I am here with our class meeting for the week. Today I have three activities for us to do. First, we're going to do a mighty minute. We're going to sing a song. Second, we're going to read a book. And last, we're going to go into my kitchen and we're going to do an art project. Are you ready? Let's get started. Let's sing our mighty minute. For our mighty minute, you're going to need your hands. We're going to be clapping our hands. Can you do this? Do this. Great job. Just like that. Are you ready? Here we go. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me. Let's clap our own, our own. Name with me, name with me, clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Roland, 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 Roland. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me, clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Ya rally, ya rally, ya rally. Rally. Great clapping, friends. All right, ready? Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Who is it? <gasps> Liam, 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 Liam. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Oliver, 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 Oliver. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Liam, Liam, Liam. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Jacob, 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 Jacob. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me, let's clap. Aram. Aram, Aram, Aram. One more, guys. Great clapping. Clap a friend's name with me, name with me, name with me. Clap a friend's name with me. Let's clap. Christopher, 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 Christopher. Whoa, we're all done. Let's clap our hands one more time and give ourselves a round of applause. Let's say yay! All right, friends, I am ready to move to our next activity. Let's see. Next, I have our book. It's called Keep Counting. In Spanish, it says Cuenta Cuenta. Hmm, let's see. We have the front cover. What do you see on the front cover? Hmm, tell your grown up. What do you see? I see a tree. I see a bus. I see a store and a car. I see a boy and I see a cat. I see lots of things. We have the back cover and we have the spine. Let's look at the book. Zero. I don't see anything. Zero. One. What do you see one of? Hmm. What do you see one of? Hmm. I see one tree. What do you see one of? Tell your grown your grown up. I see one. I see 
one boy. I see one car. I see one building. Two. What do you see two of? Hmm. Look. Now I see one, two. I see two boys. What do you see two of? Well, you're grown up. I see two. I see two trees. I see two buildings. I see two cars. Two. What do you notice about over here? Do you see any letters in this book? I don't see any letters in this book. I don't think this book has words. I think this book is going to only have numbers. Interesting. Three. What do you see three of? Hmm. I see, I see three cars. One, two, three. What do you see three of? So I see three, hmm. I see three buildings. One, two, three. I see three shelves. One, two, three. I see three shopping carts. Three. What comes next? What's this? It's number four. What do you see four of? Hmm. I see four buildings. One, two, three, four. Do you see four of anything? Tell your grown up. You say, I see four. I see four trees. One, two, three, four. I see four windows. One, two, three, four. What do you see four of? All right, let's move on. What's next? Five. What do we see five of? Hmm. I see five buildings. One, two, three, four, five. Do you see five of anything? You can tell your grown-up. I see five. Hmm. I see five cars. One, two, three, four. Uh-oh, where did five go? Oh, five. I see five cars. What do you see five of? What number comes next? Six. What do you see six of? Hmm. You know what I see six of? I see six shirts. One, two, three, four, five, six. What do you see six of? Tell your grown up. I see six. I see six trees. One, two, three, four, five, six. I see six trees. Seven. Hmm, what do we see seven of? You say, I see seven, I see seven.
seven treats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I see seven trees. What number's next? Eight. Do you see eight of anything? Hmm. You can tell your grown up. I see eight. Now look. I see eight shirts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're almost done. What comes next? Nine. Do we see nine of anything? Hmm. I see nine toys. Here's the toy store. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine. I see nine toys. Do you see nine of anything else? Tell your grown-up. All right. We just did nine. What number comes next? It's number ten. Number ten. Wow, look at the town. That's amazing. Do we see 10 of anything in this town? Hmm. Let's see. I see 10 shirts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I see 10 shirts. We're all done with the book. Here are the numbers. Should we count them? Ready? Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome counting, friends. All right, we're gonna move over to my kitchen and we are going to do a quick art project together. I'll see you over there. Hi guys, here we are in my kitchen. All right, for this art project, we are gonna need a coffee filter, water, it works best in a spray bottle, but if you don't have a spray bottle at home, that's okay, you can pour water on it, you can use a dropper, whatever works best for you. And we also need some markers. So what you're gonna do is you are going to take your markers and you are gonna draw on your coffee filter. It's good to use a lot of colors, and you can tell your mom or your dad or whoever's watching the video with you what colors we're using, what shapes you're using. So I'm gonna have you pause the video right now and go decorate your coffee filter. All right, when you're done decorating your coffee filter, maybe it looks something like this. This is mine. I used lots of colors. Let's see, I have some circles and some diamonds. I used some squiggly purple lines. So I have lots of things on my coffee filter. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my spray bottle, or this could be your dropper or your cup or whoever you wanna do this, and I'm going to spray my coffee filter so it gets all wet. Next, what I'm going to do, I'm going to fold it in half. Then I'm going to fold it again. And I'm going to fold it one more time so it kind of looks like a piece of pie. And I'm going to take it and spray it one more time. Ready? Okay. I am going to unwrap my tie-dyed coffee filter. Oh, it doesn't want to come unwrapped. 
There we go. Ta-da! So now it's nice and tie-dyed. So I'm gonna leave it to dry, and once it's dry, maybe I can hang it in my window. I hope everybody enjoyed tie-dyeing your coffee filter, and I'll see everyone later. Bye!